Hey guys, we are at Elk Park and we're in the town of Vegreville and they actually have a big elk here and Elk Park is on the entrance of Vegreville. They have a large fishing pond. You can come here in the summer and fish. I think it's probably catch and release or maybe they allow you to take a few home. I'm not really sure about that. <clears throat> but as you can see, the little lake here, the fish pond, is frozen over still. We are in April. What is the date today of April? I don't know. April the 12th. It's April the 12th. And there's still ice on this fish pond. Can you believe that? That's what you call cold. I should do a polar bear swim. I should go skinny dip in there. But no way. They locked me up. And in 1978, Queen Elizabeth <clears throat> and her late husband, Prince Philip, came to this town of Vegreville. And so they built for them this giant Ukrainian egg. And that is the attraction of this town, the giant egg. And the egg, as you can see, turns. And people come from all over to look at the egg. It's one of the many quirky attractions of rural Alberta. Giant eggs, giant sausages, all kinds of stuff. It's what they like doing here. So there you can see, August the 2nd, 1978. The Queen and Prince Philip were here. And they came through this big old egg to take a look at it. I bet they're really impressed. So, it's a nice little park out here. They have a train, CN train caboose for people to take a look at. And there's something else here. Let me take a look what this is. See, it's got some Ukrainian writing on it. Baking. Oh, really nice stained glass window. Beautiful. A tribute to all pioneers. Yep. The people who founded these areas here in rural Canada. Yeah, they were all pioneers. Life was really harsh for them back then. It was no easy life. So let's climb up on this train. Take a look. I wonder if we could go inside. No, it's locked. But anyway, there you can see what it looks like. Oh, it rocks. This thing is rocking. Let me go on the other side, see if I can get on the caboose. They should have it open so we could climb in. But it's probably because of the pandemic, you know. Now that stuff is allowed. That's why they keep it all locked off. Let's see what we can see from here. Uh-huh. Nothing spectacular. Nothing spectacular at all. So anyway guys, the main attraction here in Vegreville is the giant egg that they built. And it turns a little, has light shining on it at night. That's about it. So, Coming to you from Vegreville 
and the giant egg. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye bye.